In this lesson, we'll learn how to add interactions to widgets through a login interface. First, we create a login pop-up, which includes a username label and input field. A password label and input field. and a Confirm button. We group all components and name the group Login, then set it to Hidden. Next, we drag in a button labeled Login. Now we'll add interactions to it. Click the New Interaction button in the Interactions panel, and you'll see various event types, including mouse, keyboard, and shape events, each with several actions. We'll cover how to use these events and actions in more detail in later lessons. For now, let's add a Click or Tap action. Select Show Height action. Select the Login group, and in the Animate section, Add a fade and scale animation, choosing linear and setting it to 200 milliseconds. Under special behavior, select treat as light box, so it will display with an overlay. And check bring target to front. If we check backdrop blur, the elements behind it will appear blurred. Next, we select the confirm button and add a click or tap interaction to hide the login interface. Preview the prototype, click the Login button to show the login interface, then click the Confirm button to hide it. This is how we add interactions to widgets.